I'm about to head out for another day with my friends. Uh, hopefully I'll be um, sorting out some more stuff when I get back. Uh, but until then, it should be a good day. <laughs> that was a great day. Um, I didn't do much. I uh, had some food, got a little bit of shopping, hung out with my friend, watched loads of videos, and now it's time for dinner and home. <laughs> Okay, so I've made a bit of a pile of stuff that I want to send home. I'm going to try put it in a suitcase now and see how that fits. And see how much space I've got left. <laughs> okay, so I actually filled up more than I expected to. I've still got a little bit of space left so I could probably shove a few more things in there if I wanted. But uh, yeah, this is this bag of stuff that I want to send home. Uh, Mum, you can have those books. <laughs> um, but yeah. Okay, so it's super sunny today. Uh, not quite as warm as it is in England at the moment, which is nice, but it's still quite warm. Um, I've just finished my three days off. Uh, as I'm sure you can tell, I'm off to work. Uh, it's the start of summer school. Uh, I'm scheduled to teach six days and I have two office days, but I suspect those two office days might end up being some cover teaching or some substitute teaching or whatever. But uh, either way, I'm a little further along with preparing to leave. I booked a bed for my stay in Tokyo now, but for, but for one night before I head off. Um, I also set a date for when my SIM card expires and I actually packed my suitcase. Uh, well, you, you saw that already, but there you go. So yeah. Okay, so I just got back from my first day of teaching summer school. It's actually a lot easier than I thought it would be, um, but I'm now in the hotel. Um, I got a nice surprise. I got a ticket for breakfast which I wasn't expecting at all, so I'll be using that tomorrow morning. Um, other than that, I think it's flying ant season here, because they invaded the classroom rather quickly. So that's not fun. Uh, anyway, I'm tired, I'm sweaty, I'm going to have a shower and eat some food, and have a nice and sleep. Okay, so I'm just heading off to day two of my summer school. Should be pretty good. Um, I just wanted to show you guys something really quickly. I keep forgetting to point it out. Okay, so these raised bits here, they're um, all over the place in Japan. Uh, and they're actually for uh, blind deaf people. The uh, guide dogs are trained to follow them. They're easy to follow under your foot. So I think that's really cool. They're usually yellow, so even people who aren't deaf or blind can follow them, but yeah, I just think that's really cool and really thoughtful of the people who who just remade everything, all the pavements and stuff, in every single city and town I've been to. It's amazing. <laughs> These are the yellow ones I was talking about earlier. <laughs> Much better. Okay, so it's the end of the second day of summer school for me. Uh, another swelteringly hot day. I think it was 34 degrees Celsius or something. Um, as was the case last night, we had quite a few bugs in my very last hour, including a giant beetle that decided to crawl across my worksheets. Fun times. But uh, I found out that... Uh, Mom has get, gotten me in contact with someone in New Zealand. Uh, he's a relative. Um, I don't remember ever meeting him. I might have, I'm not sure. But um, I think he's a distant cousin or something. Um, also, I've completely forgotten this until just now. It's payday, which means I, ha I don't know how much money I've got in the bank at the moment, but it will definitely have been more than it was yesterday, so I'm looking forward to seeing that. <laughs>
Okay, so I was just stopped in the middle of the street just now by somebody. Um, they spoke English to me, which was very unusual for, you know, Japan. They usually just speak Japanese. So they just said, excuse me, do you know where a bar is? I'm trying to find somewhere to drink. I tried to help, but I don't drink myself, so I don't really know anywhere. Um, but... Uh, we got onto the topic of why I was here and I explained that I was teaching English. And then he said, oh, teach me some of your sexy English. <laughs> I left fairly quickly after that. <laughs> but that's, that's the first time that's happened to me. Mm. <laughs> okay, so I'm not sure if you can hear it, but at midday, at 6 o'clock in the morning and at 6 o'clock at night um, Oh, it's stopped now um, A piece of music is played all across Fukushima I'm not sure about other countries but definitely all across Fukushima um, and it's basically to signal lunchtime or dinner time or when to go into the fields to start working I have no idea if I've already explained this to you or not, but I'll do it anyway. Other than that, I'm just heading to my second school. So I almost missed my bus this morning, but I caught it in time. Uh, then I ended up talking to my relative in New Zealand. He's like a great guy, I can't wait to meet him in person. Um, We've planned out a few things, which is fantastic. He's going to help me a lot. And I caught a train and now I'm in Tsukugawa, ready to teach day three of summer school. And yeah. Please ignore the background music. I'm just walking past a supermarket and they have music playing all the time. But um, I've just finished my day, four lessons, it wasn't too bad, um, I think it's somewhere around ugh, 25 to 30 degrees at the moment, and it's dark, which is not fun, uh, but uh, either way, the day was pretty good, and I've got more to look forward to tomorrow. <laughs> See ya! Okay, so heading off to day four of summer school. Uh, should be pretty good. I know what I'm doing now, which is great. Uh, last night was hot. I had to keep running off to the shower so I could cool myself down. Ugh, it was awful, but anyway, should be a good day. I'll see you guys later. Okay, so it's time for me to head home after my fourth day. It wasn't so bad. I ran out of time a little bit on one or two things, but I should have expected that. Um, so it's Saturday night. I doubt I'm going to be doing anything except eating and having a shower, but it's a lot cooler, which is nice. Um, yeah, well, that brings an end to my week, and I guess I will see you next time.